In many cases, when reverse engineering of moldings, castings, topology optimization, and medical applications, a hybrid modeling workflow is the most efficient way to tackle complex parts. Hybrid modeling consists of organic shapes mixed in with prismatic shapes. There are two sub-methods in the auto-surfacing tool that will allow a streamlined workflow for this hybrid modeling style. The first method of selective surfacing is by boundary curves. By boundary curves allows the user to create 3D mesh curves on the scan data to quickly trim and create a mesh to be auto-surfaced. As you can see here, the 3D mesh curves have already been created. By checking selective surfacing, a drop-down menu will allow the user to select the boundary curves. These curves will determine what will be auto-surfaced. It is important to make sure there is enough material to be trimmed by the prismatic features. We achieve this by extending the boundaries of the mesh data. By selecting next stage, Design X will now auto-surface the trimmed organic portion of the mesh. Now with the organic auto-surface created, the user will activate the original mesh along with the region groups to create the prismatic features. Taking advantage of the DesignX modeling wizard, such as the surface primitives and the revolution wizard, the user can quickly and accurately create prismatic features to use for the trimming of the auto-surface. All the features of the model have been created. The user has efficiently and accurately created a hybrid model that composes of organic surfaces and machinable prismatic features that can now be used in a CAD package for assembly. The second method of selective surfacing is by mesh selection. Instead of using pre-drawn mesh curves, in this method, the user selects sections of the mesh they want to auto-surface by using the mesh selection tools or by the region groups. The process is similar to the by boundary curve option where the user removes the prismatic features and keeps the organic mesh for auto-surfacing, then adding the prismatic features with the modeling tools. With the region groups turned on, the user can select the fillet areas of the mesh. By activating inverse selection, everything highlighted will be kept. In this example, the user will want to check the fill holes command. Once again, taking advantage of the Design X modeling wizard, such as Surface Primitives and the Extrusion Wizard, the user can quickly and accurately create prismatic features to use for the Boolean process of the solid auto surface. As shown, the hybrid modeling workflow can now be streamlined with the functionality of selective surfacing. The user has efficiently and accurately created a hybrid model that composes of organic surfaces and machinable prismatic features that are history-based for modification and editing.